Howdy, welcome back to the Belfry Ballers. This is Tristan here, and I am finally going to start my Project Zomboid Solo series on the uh, Survivor playstyle. It's basically your standard game, vanilla. This is uh, as basic as it'll get. And I'm going to go ahead and this. Play through. And we're going to spawn a Moldra, easiest city in the game start off at um we all you always want to go lumberjack in my opinion perfect to start off he's got the uh, strength and you always want inconspicuous along with which one is it my fast reader for long term and you do want your smoker with sleepy head that leaves me with two i'm also going to grab Thin skin because even if you do get scratched, I just consider the game over. Scratch, real, maybe not a scratch, but a laceration. It's, you're just basically done. If you're unlucky enough, you might as well just take it. It gives you free points. And with that, you can take some uh, pretty nice little perks here. Adrenal Junkie wouldn't be bad, but I don't think I really need it starting off. Definitely want Stout. Stout's probably perfect for me. That's only six points. And possibly runner or graceful. You could do a really good stealth build. That's what I want here. I think I'm gonna take graceful. And yeah, this is basically the build that you'll need. It should get us through here. Character-wise, I think uh, we're just gonna go random. Frankie Lear. That sounds like a very fabulous name. He's gonna do a lot of running here, so he's gonna have fun. But yeah, let's start. This episode will go over day one, and hopefully we survive that long. But yeah, spawn in. First things first. Get to that TV. Turn that sucker on. There we go. Get that free uh, points here once it goes on it. And while it's running, we'll just do some looting here. Mini map. I like the immersion, so I always take it off. Don't kill me to press M. Yeah, we're going to take it nice and slow. Grab a kitchen knife, can opener. And all these yummy canned food. And I will eat the tuna off the bat. Just get more strength. There's also good food in here. We want all this, plus a water bottle. Uh, that's basically it. Do not do not want to overweight yourself. Cooking is rising. We will just sit here for a second and go ahead and get the broadcast over. Buy some time now that that's over. Yep, we got one level off of it. Loot the upstairs, get some free sheets. Here we go. I'll rip it all. Jacket I will wear. Oh, I guess not. I guess he still wants to rip her in half. Vitamins and soap, perfect. So it's perfect for washing. All painkillers, that's really good. Yeah, that's basically it for this house. There shouldn't be too many zombies where we spawn. One out back. We got two off the bat. They both spot me. Might be hard to take out. Just strafe them back here. Also them. We have a lot of knock back thanks to our traits. Also strong as can be. Thanks to Lumberjack. And now they're down. None has a watch for us, but it's alright. Do this. We'll kill the zombie out back just because I know he's back here. Oh, there's two. I don't see a watch on him, but he could be hiding, who knows? Quick. 
Yet. All right. Good potential houses that we could go check out here. Got plenty of daylight here to get us a home up. Oh, here's a watch. Not digital, but it will tell me the time. Ooh. We got four there. I don't think we want to go that way just yet. Not until I get a blunt weapon. This house. This is good. Picking. Come on, buddy. Push him down. Stagger him. Push. Smash his head in. Gone. Got one here. Let's see if we can call him over. Hmm, he's wanting to get in. Hopefully, there's something good in here. He's oblivious to anything behind him. Oh. Maybe not. Ah, here's our digital watch. There we go. Thank you, buddy. Alright, door's locked. And the house on us. Just fantastic. We just want to hop this fence and get in this house as quick as possible. Ooh, maybe not fate showing ourselves to the side of the house. Or the side of the road. Oh my god. That's the worst thing that could have happened. Luckily we're quick. We should be alright. We got maybe two bounced on here. Three. <laughs> maybe we're not alright. House alarms, you just gotta love them. I said they did their job and nobody's still there at least. Who decides to set their house alarm when the zombie apocalypse is going on? That's my question. We'll let a few in. Yeah, we'll, we'll let these guys in. Those are easy kills. Just get rid of them. Ooh. Close the window. Looks like they broke a window in the back of the house. I don't know where it may be in here. Upstairs. Where are you from, buddy? Kitchen knife broke. It's no fun. Guess he got mad at the noise and just decided to knock out a nice little pencil. What we need for my map. Nothing here. Good bandage here. A sheet I will take. They were getting a little heavy though. Don't want our character to get too heavy. We'll get tired quicker. Nothing here yet. We really need a warehouse. Got at least two outside. Screwdriver, that's good. Toolbox. See if there's a hammer in it. Nothing. Okay, we will leave it. Maybe we can mac and cheese real quick. Fast forward time. Okay. Take the kitchen off. I need a bell pepper and all we're stuffed. Ooh. Sorry, scary a character, but hey. It is what it is. So we're gonna get out of here. We need to go this way. We need to get to commercial buildings really. Or the uh, pharmacy, uh, I like the pharmacy a bunch. I think we're near it. We should be near the pharmacy. 
Go nice and slow. Playing it like Call of Duty will. And then you're dying. Generator in here though. It's a good find for late game. Another shit. I'm gonna mark this though. Jump on that fence. I could have swore I heard a zombie on the other side, so I'm really not going to uh, risk my life trying to get through a fence. Let's see here. Homes, homes, homes. There's the main road. I'll check this house out real quick. Garbage bag, perfect. So I can. What was that? Sound like a zombie. See one there, but put my canned food in here. Don't need a kitchen knife. Or that. Put my sheet. That's pretty heavy. There we go. Please don't be another house alarm. Close this window. We were alright. We ain't doing too bad. Not too many zombies. There's a lot of stuff in this house. Back up. Get one arm pushed. No, nothing good there. Close this curtain. Matches. There we go. Can find some cigarettes. Bandage here. It's the best bandage you can use in the game for healing effectiveness. I think the adhesive is just because it looks cooler, but. And a hammer. Whoo! Got a lot of good base building. I really need to find a place, but I don't want to build really far out away from all the uh, commercial buildings. I don't. Ooh. That's little wolvies. Where are we? There we go. So we got some blue building. I think it's a church, though. But it's better than nothing. Do not want these zombies to see me. Drifter is getting hot. I might have to drop my. Uh, where is it here? I'm pretty sure I gotta probably drop my lumberjack shirt. Just because you spawn with two articles of clothes. Pretty sure we can find cigarettes in here. So this will help. Another. I swear. Oh shoot. There's just no way there's two house alarms. That never happens to me. Oh my god. Take our time here. So many zombies now. Wow, they do not like being trapped on that side, do they? Yeah, we should be in extreme panic, and we are. Oh lord, they're everywhere. Two house alarms. It's crazy. So, alright, we're gonna lose them in the woods here. Let's help get rid of them. Oh, yeah, these are nice thick woods here. Ooh, that building looks interesting. Any zombies that follow, I... Oh my god. Maybe not. <laughs> just evidently the whole town can just hear... Ooh. I mean, look, they just keep coming. 
the full bag. If I could snatch that, it'd be really nice, but me zombies will be looking at way too many. Don't throw anything on that guy. Okay, we're at the school. It's good. Get a free backpack in here if we can get in it. Oh wow, no house alarm? <laughs> Holy cow. Alright. Open, 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 open. Shut. Oh god. Open, open, open. Shut. Well, looks like we're taking the exit. Character is getting tired from all this sneaking around. What? We are never getting out of here. Half this episode is just going to be running for my life. Just bring them all on over. Do some, uh, we'll do some fast forwarding here. Just because this can get tedious. And if you do this. Oh, it's not chopped wood. If we do this, our character will pick the quickest route to get through. Just take him in the woods here. And we will walk this way. A little bit. Now we will cut in. A few zombies in here, but nothing crazy. Goal is just not get scratched. You're a thin skin, so any damage we take is going to result in a scratch. Why would four zombies just be chilling out in the woods? Or everywhere. It's it's crazy without an axe. It's so hard. Alright, no tail. We can loot this. Hopefully, you know, there's not a whole horde waiting on me. Gas station, too. Like to this gas station at the least. Oh no. So, like, if you use an actual person in this, you can't tell me that. This does not look like there's no hope. Like, look at this. I mean, it's just oh, fudge. It's just zombies on each turn. Oh, character does not want to jump. I think it's because he's tired. Just need to get in a home. Guy won't jump. Police house alarm, go off. Another church. Where are we on the map? Okay, we're getting a lot of exploring out of the way at least. I think I'm in the house, good. For sale house, meaning nothing in it. This house would not be a bad choice here. Because we got the woods here, I could... If I'm getting chased by a horde, just take them through here and get to my house. You know what? I'll fight them. Ooh, don't take all day now.
They're coming. Maybe not, maybe they're not coming. I need to just try the door first. Ooh, four. Kidding. Okay. Don't hit him. <laughs> maybe I only pulled two. Well, yeah, three. No, back up now. One. There we go. Stay on the ground, honey. You too. Back up. Mm. <sighs> Ooh, that's close. do a slight damage that is due to going inside going to the woods and you can get scratches just basically like twigs hmm I need an item to hand fork will do I really don't want to live in the house as a broken window just because Oh my gosh, we have a rifle in here. Maybe it is a sign to live here. We'll put it on our back. Gun ain't bad. Oh wow, and a double gun. So basically when you get events like these, these are, uh, he's two on them, that's kind of weird. These are uh, suicide victims. So I will take both for the moment, just so that I can, um, if I can carry them. I'll bring both, but I'll put them in the bag here, see what it does. Hmm. Try the ammo. Plastic bag isn't the best for carrying, but it does get the job done. If I can bring all these guns, that's nice. There's more weapons later down the road if I last that long. You know what, we'll just put this in the bag. I'll definitely be able to walk around. Nope, doesn't really make a difference, does it? Okay, in that case, go back on my back. Speed this up. Alright, there we go. Character is getting tired now, as you can tell. Oh, wow, steak. Eat all that. Nice. And I will take the corn with me. We can carry 18 pounds. That's why I wanted all the uh, good traits here. This wouldn't be a bad place, but... Pff, nah, ain't about it. Like a two-story, but wow. They want me to fight for that one, so... Maybe this house. Just to start off. That would be perfect, but <laughs> how many zombies am I going to see around it? The whole town is just about clustered in two spots. Right next to a food market, too. We could loot that next, next episode. Okay, we've got a few here. I'm going to take that out. See, sometimes when they roll over, they will keep crawling, so you got to watch out for that. Because they will do that, stun you, and if there's a whole horde on you, that results in death. Luckily, they don't scratch you when you do that, or I would not get any close to the. Have I already looted this home? I don't think I have. Come on. No house alarm. I hear a zombie. First things first, clear the house. If 
He could be upstairs or he could be outside, so. First, check outside. No one. Check over here. Nothing. Nice home. We got fences around it. You can drive a car right up to it. Put my bell pepper in here. Juice box. And I think I had corn. I hear him. Where is he? He's upstairs. Oh, yeah. There's another one, too. If you grab the death trait, you can't hear that, so. Come on. Thank you. Clear. Angler ain't bad. She's definitely in this room. Don't break that glass. Come on. Sleeping tablets. It's good. So we're going to put our guns in the. Uh, we've got Breda. I think Bredas are so cool. Play that. I'm going to put all my guns in the uh, drawer, dresser upstairs here. The cabinet. I'm going to the ammo here. We have some ammo starting off with both. It's really good. Okay. I'll clear the rest of the house. Boots. Boots are perfect. Love wearing boots in the game. Okay. Not many curtains, though, in the house. Don't open the window. Will you open it? No, okay. Angler Magazine. I'll read this real quick. Thanks, I got Fast Reader. Okay. Up, upstairs is clear. It's looking good here. I'm going to add a sheet to this one 100%. And we're going to close it. I'm also going to put all my some food up. Chips. Oven, okay. I want to put the rest of the stuff in this one. Get that up. It's 8 o'clock. It's getting late now. Uh, bandage. Where's my corn? Sheets. Keep those. Keep those. Keep those. Need all that. But now battery. Don't need this at all. Shove it in here for now. Baseball cap. Put it over here. Eh, maybe not. Yeah, might as well. Who cares? We ain't gonna be here long. This is just temporary for the first night. Okay, we'll eat this peach. So our character... So now we're very tired. Next one's ridiculously tired. And it's no fun. Press B. We'll pull up our build menu here. Uh, in general, I just want to see if I can craft a sheet. So, you can rip. But I'm pretty sure you cannot craft any. So, if I wanted to sheet up the whole room, I'd have to go loot. Neighboring home. There's nearest one's over there. Got a zombie. Take him out. In case he does a little sneaky little crawl over here. Like he did. And he still got me. It's hard to counter. Get to time a kick on him and stun him out of it. So many more hits it takes. He'll probably do the same. Nope. Yeah. Get him against a wall and push him, they fall a lot quicker. Nice. So, that's really it. Don't want no police shirts or nothing. Okay. This looks like the uh, temporary base here. The little home here. So we know where we're at. And I found a ladder. 
Oh, I need a cigarettes. I hear more zombies too. I hear them, but oh, there you are. Mm, my eyeballs, look at that hurt. Come on. Last thing I want to do before I send my character to the bed here, we want to get these corpses out of here. This is going to overweight me. Oh, didn't grab him, but. What? Another zombie? Your character will get sick. These bo the bodies do start decaying. Dang. I just want to go ahead and move him out of the way, too. So basically, you just carry it. You can bury him, but I don't got the time for that. Lost my bag here. I don't know. I think I'm holding it. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we want to get all these corpses outside the house. A lot of blood. I don't think you can really um get rid of them. Sadly, I wish you get like a mod for it. Because I'm not able to clean the ground or nothing. Oh. Okay. Cool little vault. Now, yeah, as you can tell, we're r ridiculously tired. Also, don't help that I have sleepy head. But hey. That's how it goes then. Alright. Downstairs is secure. Turn our light off in our room here. And we'll put our shoes up. Rest is alright. Our character is extremely tired. Turn off all the lights. And we're going to sleep, basically, until we wake up here. Probably about 4 or 5. Oh, wow. We slept for a while. To 8.30 in the morning. You can never be sure here. Usually you'll hear the zombies bust in, but... Well, we seem to be alright. First day was a success. We need to find a TV for Life and Living, though. And you start reading. But yeah. That was the first day. Pretty easy. Ran into some hiccups with the uh, house alarms. But nothing that I can't handle. Let's get us cleaned up here before we end the episode. Alright. We are wet, but we should be fine. Alright. Thanks for watching episode one here. Hopefully this goes for a while. Hopefully we can go for six more episodes at least. Um, it will get harder because I will get more cocky as time goes once I get an axe. Basically, you'll see here. But Anyways, thanks for watching. Um, if you join the video, like it, please. But you don't guys subscribe. I don't care. But uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you all next episode.